The 3M Petri Film Salmonella Express System is a qualitative pathogen test used for the rapid detection and biochemical confirmation of salmonella in enriched foods and food process environmental samples. The Petri Film Salmonella Express System consists of 3M Salmonella Enrichment Base and 3M Salmonella Enrichment Supplement, a unique medium for recovery and growth of salmonella species. 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Plate, a sample ready to use chromogenic culture medium system that contains a cold water soluble gelling agent and is selective and differential for salmonella, providing a presumptive result. 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Confirmation Disc, a biochemical substrate that facilitates the biochemical confirmation of salmonella organisms. As with all microbiology methods, Please perform good laboratory practices and wear appropriate personal protective equipment when setting up samples and performing testing. Here are the procedures for using the 3M Petri Film Salmonella Express System. Before using your 3M Petri Film Salmonella Express plates for testing, check the color of the hydrated plates gel to ensure that the plates have not been exposed to extreme high temperatures. Remove one plate from the pouch and dispense two milliliters of sterile distilled water, reverse osmosis water, or Butterfield's phosphate diluent onto the plate. Carefully roll down the top film to close the 3M Petri Film Salmonella Express Plate, and to prevent air bubbles, place the 3M Petri Film Flat Spreader on the center of the plate. Press gently on the center of the spreader to distribute the diluent evenly. After a few minutes, check the hydrated plate gel color using the 3M Petri Film Salmonella Express Hydrated Plate Color Card. If the gel color is red, the plates are good to use. If the gel color is orange to brown, the plates have been exposed to extreme high temperatures and product performance may be impacted. Do not use the plates and contact your local 3M food safety representative. The next step is the enrichment procedure. In order to prepare one liter of 3M salmonella enrichment base, weigh 37 grams of dehydrated base powder and add it to one liter of water. Follow the product instructions to mix, dissolve, and sterilize the media. To prepare the 3M salmonella enrichment supplement, Weigh 50 milligrams plus or minus two and a half milligrams of the 3M Salmonella Enrichment Supplement using an analytical balance. Temper the sterilized base to 20 to 42.5 degrees Celsius and then add 50 milligrams of supplement. Shake the base supplement container vigorously to effectively dissolve and mix the supplement with the base solution. After weighing your product sample, add the appropriate volume of base with supplement to the product sample. Homogenize the sample according to your laboratory procedures and incubate the sample in a 41.5 degrees plus or minus 1 degree Celsius incubator for 18 to 24 hours. The next step is the hydration procedure. To hydrate the 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Plate, Place the 3M Petri Film Salmonella Express Plate on a flat level surface. Lift the top film and with the pipette held vertically, dispense 2.0 milliliters of the prescribed sterile diluent onto the center of the bottom film. Do not close the top film before dispensing the entire 2.0 milliliter volume. Gently roll down the top film onto the diluent to prevent trapping air bubbles and place the 3M Petrifilm flat spreader on the center of the plate. Press gently on the center of the spreader to distribute the diluent evenly. Remove the spreader and leave the 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express plate undisturbed for at least one minute. Place the 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express plate on a flat surface for at least one hour at room temperature. 20 to 25 degrees Celsius and less than 60% relative humidity, protected from light to allow the gel to form. An aluminum foil tray is being used here. 
The next step is streaking your enriched product samples onto the pre-hydrated 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Plate. Remove the enrichment medium from the incubator after the required incubation period and agitate its contents by hand. For low background microbial load samples, proceed directly with streaking the enriched sample onto a hydrated 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Plate. For high background microbial load samples, perform a secondary enrichment step by performing the following. Transfer 0.1 milliliter of enrichment medium to 10 milliliters pre-warmed 3M RVR10 broth. Incubate the RVR10 at 41.5 degrees plus or minus 1 degree Celsius for 8 to 24 hours. The incubation range allows for laboratory flexibility. After the secondary enrichment incubation, proceed directly to streaking onto a hydrated 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Plate. To streak the enriched sample medium onto a hydrated 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Plate, use a sterile 10 microliter loop to withdraw each sample from the enriched food sample. Be sure to use a smooth loop without jagged edges or distortion so that the plate gel surface is not damaged during streaking. Place the pre-hydrated plate on a flat surface. You can either hold the top film open with one hand, or you can lay the top film flat down on the surface. Perform a single streak of the inoculum, starting at the top of the plate and streaking to the bottom of the plate. This will allow you to obtain isolated colonies. Carefully roll down the top film to close the 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Plate. Gently apply a sweeping motion with even pressure across the top film to remove any air bubbles in the inoculation area. Next is the plate incubation stage. Place each plate in a horizontal position with the colored side up in stacks of no more than 20 plates. Incubate the plates at 41.5 plus or minus 1 degree Celsius for 24 plus or minus 2 hours. The next step in testing is interpretation for presumptive positive salmonella colonies. Now look at the isolated colonies for salmonella species. Presumptive positive salmonella species are red to brown colonies with a yellow zone with an associated gas bubble or both. An associated gas bubble is defined as being located within one colony diameter distance from the colony. All other colony colors and types are non-salmonella species. If you have found presumptive positive salmonella colonies, perform the following steps. First, take out a permanent ultra-fine tip marker and circle a minimum of five isolated presumptive positive salmonella colonies on the 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Plate top film. Second, biochemically confirm all circled salmonella presumptive positive results using the 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Confirmation Disc. To begin biochemical confirmation, Remove an individually packaged 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Confirmation Disc from its pouch and allow it to come to room temperature. Peel the package to expose the disc's tab. Grasp the tab and remove the disc. Insert the disc by rolling it onto the gel so that you avoid entrapping air bubbles. Then close the plate. Next, gently apply a sweeping motion with even pressure across the top film in order to remove any air bubbles in the inoculation area and assure good contact between the plate's gel surface and the 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express Confirmation Disc. Incubate the plate and disc at 41.5 plus or minus 1 degree Celsius for 4 to 5 hours. After incubation, remove the disked plate from the incubator and proceed with reading the results, focusing only on the circled colonies. Colonies that are green to blue, blue to dark blue or black, or have a blue precipitate around them are biochemically confirmed positive for Salmonella species. 
colonies that remain the same red, dark red, or brown color without a blue precipitate are negative for Salmonella species. Finally, if the 3M Petri film Salmonella express plates cannot be analyzed within one hour of removal from the incubator, circle the presumptive Salmonella colonies on the top film with a permanent ultra-fine tip marker. Place the plates in a sealed plastic bag. Make sure to protect the 3M Petri film Salmonella express plates from light and store the plates at negative 20 to negative 10 degrees Celsius for no longer than 72 hours. Before adding the disc to the plate, allow the plates to warm to 20 to 25 degrees Celsius. With each type of 3M Petri film plate, an interpretation guide with reminders for use is provided to guide you through storage, sample preparation, plating, incubation, and interpretation of your test results. Product instructions are also available online and contain complete product information. 3M Food Safety provides more solutions to help you save labor time, reduce costs, and support the reliability of your quality assurance efforts. And when you use the 3M Petrifilm Salmonella Express System and other 3M food safety products, you have a reliable partner for technical and customer services. For answers to your questions or for more information on how 3M food safety can help increase lab efficiency in your facility, please contact us at 1-800-328-6553 or visit our website at www.3m.com forward slash 3M Pathogen Solutions, forward slash SALX. 3M and Petrifilm are trademarks of 3M.